Hi, I'm Leo Tabak of the Golf Performance Academy, located at the Hyatt Hills Golf Complex. This is the first tee. This is the area that we've been waiting for for maybe a week, maybe two weeks, maybe a month. But this is the one that we've watched tour players on the LPGA and PGA Tour hit it. This is our tour. This is our spot to have an enjoyable day and shoot the lowest number possible with whatever we have brought to the dance that day. That means whatever swing you have, whatever pictures you have, whatever feelings you have, we need to apply it. But this is the first tee. And the first tee is one that breeds a little excitement, anxiousness, anxiety, all perfectly normal because we care. So we need to secure a level spot between the club face and our feet, the bottom of the club and the balance of your body. And whenever possible, it's advisable to stand on the left side of the tee so you can make a golf swing that goes out and around, follows the path of your shoulders for a basic shot, a straight shot, or one that might move right to left. So at this moment, we take a rehearsal swing, and a rehearsal swing is not a mechanical effort. It's a feeling. Remember, we haven't hit golf balls for a week. Maybe we played last week, but we haven't hit anything. We haven't held a club. And we have three other partners with us that want to enjoy their day also. But you're going to have an advantage, or at least those of you who watch this video. We've just rehearsed it. We stand directly behind the golf ball in the direction we'd like to play. This hole is shaped from right to left and the flag stick is in our left corner. Once you walk in, there's a rhythm, there's a balance, there's a flow. It belongs to you. and you enjoy yourself with a beautiful day, no matter where that ball was struck. So my ball just happens to be sitting on the 100 yard marker. The flag stick that we're looking at is tucked left corner. That's the distance, that's the position of the flag stick. Now we need to understand the position of the ball, which is below my feet, which will breed this shot as a left to right shot and higher than normal. Next, it's the balance of our body. The weight is equally distributed on a flat lie, on a downhill below you. In this case, there's more weight on my right foot and the ball position will be closer or will be left of my center. This is to ensure that the ball comes up spinning. This is just about 97 yards. And works the ball left to right. Now, that particular shot was the, not the one I desired or saw, but it's on the green and we keep playing the game. That's the key to an enjoyable round of golf to find out your, real, your true potential. You keep going. You don't stand here and make adjustments. So we're gonna repair the ball mark. pushing the turf to the middle. I've already gauged the levelness of the green. We marked it and so now let's just get an overview. You've already hit putts on the putting green. The putting green is the same speed as the golf course.
For those of you who use a line on the ball, you line the ball in the direction you'd like to travel. I'm going to rehearse my swing 18 inches behind the ball so I have enough force to reach the other side of the flagstick. I'm walking in staring down the line. And we go blank with rhythm and balance. And we keep moving. This is all about playing the game. This is not about perfection. This is a firm uphill, slight left to right. So you know that feeling we just had? That's perfectly normal. You're not comfortable, you walk away. And you set up again, same routine. Speed of play is not a challenge. I'm Leo Tabak, owner and operator of the Golf Performance Academy. Enjoy the two hours and 15 minutes.